like the video and subscribe if you love Roblox. Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this video we are here back inside a build a boat once again and you guys may know the RB battles green bit has been found inside a build a boat and this bit is a little bit complicated to actually unlock. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to win the mini game every single time or like majority of times you will win this by doing the strategy. So make sure you guys stay tuned and also if you could like the video and subscribe it'd be very very much appreciated because we are closing in on the RB Battles event coming to Build About very, very soon, and I'm super excited to see what that has to bring to the game. Brand new update to Build About. It's going to be awesome, so make sure I subscribe, turn on that notification bell, because I will show you guys how to actually get that badge when this does come out. But anyway, right here, we're going to go over and enter the secret room. So first of all, we're going to need to do is we're going to need to build the key here. So hopefully, my game is not bugged, and hopefully, I can actually make this thing. So let's go over here, and let's grab a, a seat just like this. Come on, is this going to work? Come on. Uh, key? Um, any day, any day now build a boat um uh hello all right so when you guys actually build the key i would recommend doing it towards the plot and like towards the beginning here because if you don't do that well then it's probably not gonna work and nice my key is bugged how does skeleton get it every time bro my, my character it doesn't let me pick up the key sometimes mr skeleton's gotta build it for me it's i don't know if this happens to you guys as well but sometimes when you make the key it doesn't allow you to pick it up so mr skeleton has to build it for me and then i can pick up his key it's kind of weird but anyway now let's go over into the secret room and we're gonna get into how you guys can actually win this thing every single time and let's go ahead and do this right, so we're gonna go over here and we're gonna enter the book colors we're gonna go yellow red a purple blue and green just like that we're gonna open this find our yellow chest over here insert the key and then wa bam wa boom all right this door is gonna open up and um say hello to mr plushy guy right here oh skeleton is uh well we're getting we're getting lifted up here all right, anyway, it's opened up. So now you guys can see these mini games right here. All right, let me just give you guys a brief rundown of how this thing works. So you guys can see there's going to be these red squares throughout this board of other squares. So you have two bombs. So right here, this looks like it's an easy board. And I'm going to show you guys. There's one strategy you can do for this. And it's guess and checking where you can literally just guess uh, the entire time and like try to unlock all the squares. But that would be very, very hard. Now, I might have just guessed this first try. Oh, no, I didn't. All right, so I came decently close i have a couple of squares left but you guys can see the whole point of the game is to eliminate the squares with only two bombs so there's actually a strategy for this game to get it every single time because it can be quite frustrating doing this over and over again and you guys can see mr skeleton is about to do it with the strategy right here look at he's about to he's about to win this one right here look at this first level one and you guys can see uh will he make it there he goes he made it first try just like that and there's a simple trick to actually do this and you guys will see oh it's gonna it's gonna open up look at look at we can find a secret number it is uh two two seven six one that is the code to open up the door so skeleton's gonna put that in and it'll literally work it's as simple as this now i'm gonna show you guys the strategy to do this all right this looks like a decent good board so let's go over and do what i'm gonna do is i'm going to take a screenshot okay i'm actually going to be using photoshop for this but you guys can use any other like website at ed photo editing it's really easy you guys can find many things like for example let me find one so for example there's many websites this is one i found online right here all right there's there's many programs out there that you can actually use using photoshop because it is the easiest and what we're actually going to do is we're gonna look at this chart right here actually we're not gonna use this one we're gonna use another one so what i'm actually gonna be doing is i have a one right here it's level one so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to grab my shape tool and this could be used in literally anything like i said like it could be any program that has a shape tool so i'm going to find a pin on this on this map here and basically since you get no redos once you actually mess up it's ba we're basically playing the game without actually playing the game that's literally the whole point of this so you guys can see i'm gonna make a color literally any color here and i'm going to find find a spot on this board now you want to actually look where like the lines connect and where you can actually get the most squares eliminated like right up here I definitely want to put something up here because this is where it looks like I can el eliminate a bunch of them like maybe even this dot right there that looks pretty good so let's see where that one actually uh wh what that eliminates right there so we know that for sure eliminates oh whoops uh the line tool is the best tool to use this with it's going to eliminate that it's going to eliminate that it also goes diagonal as well guys so this one will also eliminate probably one down here if I drag this line all the way down it'll probably eliminate go through that one so using lines like this actually helps out a ton all right so I'm looking at this right I see this one looks a little bit better like I said guys you just want to keep on just guessing and checking and drawing the lines and seeing which one this we get two bombs by the way to use so look at that boom it eliminates all that stuff and then all you need to do now since we know all those are eliminated all we now got to do is find one that can eliminate uh, the ones down here 
uh, which is uh, this one right here. We eliminate that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one, right? So we have to eliminate all four of those. So now we got to find another square to eliminate those. All right, so then you guys can see, I guessed and checked once again where I am. This one, if you put it on the bottom, it eliminates three, right? So you want to find where you can eliminate most. So then this one also eliminates the diagonal that goes this way. I feel like I'm teaching a math class right now. Like, that's genuinely what it feels. I feel like I'm one of those math tutorial YouTubers that you look up when you're when you're crying in your uh, family room and your dad's trying to help you with the homework, but you can't figure it out, so you start crying. So then instead of relating to your dad's help, you relate to the guy on YouTube who, like, you know, does, like, the whiteboard and stuff. Any anyway, you guys get the point. So now let's go over inside of the game and actually input our points and get these things done All right now I'm going to actually import the one on the bottom right there and I'm gonna click and boom you guys will see Just like this it should it really should eliminate all of these I'm going to cry if it doesn't and boom just like that the line method works, but there's another method There's another method. This is skeletons method that I'm gonna show you guys skeleton has got this down All right, he's actually solved this a ton of time. All right, this is now skeleton strategy Now this one works if you don't want to use like any of the line methods all that stuff You can actually pretty much do it in game So what you want to do is find a spot on the board like I said that eliminates most of the points So I see right on the bottom here. I can definitely eliminate four of the points So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place my bomb now I can actually go back and undo that if I really wanted to and what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna trace where this is actually going to hit so I know it's not gonna hit anything up the, up on the top it is going to eliminate four on the bottom here and it also will eliminate this corner one and it also will eliminate if I press two keys at once it should eliminate oh it actually eliminates nothing over there so I don't know if this is the correct spot that I want to put it in I might test out another spot so if I wanted to go over here I'm just gonna click on that let's see if I put it right here that's still gonna eliminate the bottom I'm gonna eliminate this top one it should eliminate, um, if I go to the left here, it should, oh, it passes through that one, so we can't do that. This one is a lot easier to see. I wish they would have a different color for, like, the, the trace, because it's kind of hard to see with all the gray. So this one right here, this one lines up, is going to eliminate these three. We chose a different board because, uh, the other board was kind of a little bit weird. So this will actually eliminate a grand total of one, two, three, four, five, and potentially even six. Uh, so this one, this bomb right here will eliminate six of the squares. So that's pretty much half of them already gone. And then there's another one as well that if we put it like, we want to probably do something up here because we need these eliminated. So this one right here, something on this line, I feel like, because all the diagonals lead to this. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to put it right here. So we get this line, we get the diagonal there, and that one over there we don't have to worry about. So anyway, let's go ahead and place this one right here and do this. And this one should go off, I feel like. Yeah, this one, this one will definitely do it. Hopefully that corner will hit it just like that. And boom, completed once again. And this is level two. Now, we actually got this thing all the way up to level five, I think, which was extremely hard. I can't even lie. But uh, yeah, anyway, um, you can see you guys can get the code from looking inside the screen. That's what, 2761? 2761. Uh, that was it right there. You guys can see, vault open. It's that easy, guys. So if this did help you out, make sure to go ahead and like the video, subscribe, and skeleton. Look how easy this one looks right here on this level this level three right here that looks pretty easy i can't even lie but anyway make sure you guys like the video subscribe and i'll see you guys inside the next one peace out and goodbye